placement. All right. Why Trump's victory, um, how Trump's victory is actually going to be ushering in the end of some of this insane gender ideology that we've seen reap havoc across the nation the past 10 plus years. And I was somebody that early on was speaking out against it. And I got called all the phobes in the book, homophobic, transphobic, all the phobics. I got, I got those labels, all right? And uh, it caused friction with friends. I got called heartless. I got called on Christ like I got called all sorts of things because I recognized what was plain plainly obvious that it was insane that we were going along with men pretending that they were women. And I recognize it as insane, but the rest of the world descended into madness. And the few of us that held on to reality were gaslight and it gaslight and made to seem like we were uh uncompassionate, unloving monsters because we didn't think it was a good idea to be uh, giving children puberty blockers and getting them on gender affirming care and ultimately, you know, mutilating their genitalia. Well, it turns out we were right, as usual. It was insane. And I said it before, and I'll say it again, that history will not look kindly upon people that went along with this madness. And I, for one, am grateful that I was not one of the the people that participated in this grand lie that was um, uh, perpetrated, uh, perpetuated on the masses. 